it's the whole thing. There's an actual snail in there. Are you going to rescue this little snail? Good job. Hi parental units, welcome to Pacific Northwest Geek Mom. I'm Sarah and this is my son Devin and we're going to be doing a special pumpkin carving today. We have one of these nice big cool board pumpkins, they're sometimes called fairy tale pumpkins I think, and a regular large carving pumpkin. I have two of my garden pumpkins, these are sugar pumpkins that I grew myself in my garden. There's actually a third one but it's too little. The little pumpkins will get googly eyes. These tools you can get at the grocery store and they are so perfect for pumpkin carving. Um, they're not going to hurt you, they're not sharp, but they have these serrated, edge serrated edges that will go through the pumpkin flesh no problem. And they come in different sizes and they usually come with a book of jack-o'-lantern pattern. This one's just a awl. <laughs> and then I have a dry erase marker because pumpkins you can wipe the your design on and off. My little helper here is already scratched up my pumpkins and put dirt on them but that's okay that's what he's here for. Um, so at the end I think you'll see the surprise. So let's do pump a pumpkin first. That's this one. I'll uh, do a little sketching on here and then show you. Yeah. 